Hey there, it's Mark. Welcome to Trucking Tuesday here on Race Crews Gaming. I'll be doing Trucking Tuesday on Twitch in just a couple hours. If you have a Twitch account, give me a follow. I'm just over 30 followers, shooting for 50. I'll be starting at 12 o'clock noon here in California, or California time. Pacific, you know what I mean. Let's go ahead and pick a truck for today's video. Not that truck, I use it every Thursday for a checkpoint audit. Let's use this one. Deathstroke, it looks like a truck. Uh, like a... SUV? Kind of Hummerish, I guess. Well, I want to use it. Because I, I don't get to drive with it very often. Do you have this truck in your collection? What about the Hot Wheels Character Cars version? I have that one too. One of these days we're going to use Wiley e. Coyote. I think it's a truck. It looks like a pickup with a rocket in the back, don't you think? I went to the community track section and this is the first track that appeared. Weird Science 2. Looks kind of wild. Sure, let's go for it. Let's see if these mini trailers reveal anything special about the track or important that I should know. Because when it shows the map, it just shows you like the skeletal outline of the track. It doesn't show you if they use any sidewalls, any flags, arrows, boosters, charge up strips, magnetic strips. You, can, you don't get to see that. Has a boost bar. I always forget to double check when I pick the vehicle. Uh oh, gotta go slow up that hill. Checkpoint right away, very good. I'm going to drive steady, a little cautious since I don't know the track. Except for that first hill, you know. Another reason to drive cautious is because I don't know how this vehicle handles. Well, this spiral might be a little long for my taste. When you build a track, you can build it how you want. It's your track, but it might affect if people choose it for multiplayer. To be honest, I know people are going to pick it because there's some people who love long, boring stretches of loops. Right now I'm in time attack mode, so it might seem boring. Maybe it's more exciting in multiplayer. Maybe you have some cars battling it out right here. While the track does have checkpoints, I have noticed some opportunities for shortcuts, so I'm going to do a second lap and show you. However, I'm going to trim down that second lap, just kind of show highlights. This way we can skip these long parts. Maybe you've been looking for shortcuts too, have you? Have you noticed when I fly through the air, sometimes there might be areas for shortcuts? Not that one. These Humpty Dumps are kind of fun. A bit challenging. Good if you have a boost bar. The boost bar gives you a chance to correct your position. If it was like a boost pod, you would use the whole boost and you would just flash yourself way further than you need to go. That was kind of cool, an open vertical loop. I want to go back and kind of check out how they did it. Excuse me. Uh, I, I want to do a little uh, corporate espionage, see how they did it. I might want to do it. Not only that, when I leave, which way do I go? Do I go down this magnetic track? Yep. This is interesting. There's some curves for us to do some drifting, but they're not like uh, horizontal or vertical. We're kind of at an angle. Gives it a unique uh, perspective. I don't use a lot of magnetic track, but when I do, I use it like this. Put in curves so people get a chance to build up some boost. Wow, a lot of variety in this track. Now we're going off-road. Then we come to a track platform. Back off-road. Another track platform. Off-road again, I see it. Back up. Back off. Back up. Missed it. Okay, that was my first lap. 
my time. Three minutes, 34 seconds. Let me show you some shortcuts. There are some spots on the track, vertical U-turns. Yeah, those are very shortcuttable. If checkpoints were added before the entrance to these vertical U-turns, that would take care of the problem. I shouldn't say problem. Maybe they like them here. However, if they don't want people to shortcut the track, that's what I'm talking about. Overall, a nice track. I know you can beat three minutes if you use both shortcuts. Happy racing. See you tomorrow and see you in just a bit on Twitch. Bye bye.